The All Blacks at Ireland have met 18 times since 1905, and apart from a drawn game in 1973, the All Blacks have won each and every match. The last of those in Dublin just six months ago. Tonight here in Hamilton, Ireland get yet another chance to break their duck as they come south with their triple crown winning side led by inspirational captain Brian O'Driscoll. And for the All Blacks tonight, it's test number one of 13 in 2006. And Coach Henry isn't necessarily playing his very best starting 15 as he rotates a very large squad of 39 players. anticipation of this match as the All Black season for 2006 is underway kickoff made by Ogara and uh, Kevin Mialamu takes it in for the All Blacks just near the 22 metre line and Kelleher a wobbly pass but McAllister does well with it and uh, lays it back here's uh, an early touch for Clark Dermody the big Southland prop forward has got his hands on the ball early as it comes to Kelleher again and uh, through goes Molly Aina. Here's an opportunity straight away. Major with a big sprint coming up. Can he do it? He's looking for uh, Doug Howlett. And the wing is going in. Boy, what a start to the season. What a start to the season. A change for the All Blacks. They've made an early one in the second half. Jerome Kaino in 19 for Marty Holler. Well, that's an interesting call, but you couldn't help but notice the elation on the faces of the All Blacks. Conversion attempts, and he's nailed it. So the All Blacks bounce back early in the second half. A try scored by Mills Bulliaina is 14th in Test Rugby. Beautifully executed by the All Blacks. Well, it was. It was a glorious try. But, of course, this is the way the first half started. Can the Irish answer back? Kickoff made by O'Gara. Jerome Kaino is out there. Test debut for him. As uh, it's not well taken down, and it's uh, Neil Best for Ireland as the All Blacks uh, botched it at kickoff time. Coming now to Stringer, although it's a bit slow. The pressure. McAllister kicks off. Troy Flavel back in the All Black team for the first time since 2001. O'Gara chased down by uh, Flavel. He makes an immediate impact. Or was it Kaino? It was uh, Jerome Kaino. Well, both those two players you mentioned, there's both Kaino and Flavel, have the ability to make an impact. So I'm pleased to see this man back in black. Knocked down by an Irish player, but the All Blacks still have it. Again, there it is for Cowan. At Waikato Stadium. Back for McAllister. He steps outside the 22. Down the middle it goes to Jordan Murphy. And the big fullback, kick and chase. Mialamu going back, but Murphy's done well. Off to do Oh, Driscoll. McCraw put him down, but here's O'Connell. Intercept made by McAllister. And he gets it across to Major. Now the race is on. Howlett going back with Trimble. Soyalo makes the tackle inside the 22. How did Soyalo get there? Boy, this will test the fitness as... 11, 11. Ireland have to get back behind the ball, which they've managed to do. Some quicker than others. And Stringer lobs the little kick in. Horgan's coming after this. Gets a bad bounce. But it falls now for Nanu. Nanu got it away. And welcome back to Troy Flavel. By the a minute. With time showing. Oh, 
off the posts. So it's no goal. And O'Driscoll comes roaring back with it. Tips it off. Beautiful play. O'Driscoll is somebody on the field. And away goes Horgan. Ireland with one last crack at it as a stringer. Again, the kick put uh, through, and uh, it's been charged by Ma'anonu. Ball bounces back, and the All Blacks have got a few lined up here. Mialamu to Sotlialo, McCaw, Rokafoko. Again, it's with Sotlialo. Cowan for McAllister, tips it through, snapped up by Stringer. He's fired it back, Horgan has it. And they're going backwards here. The All Blacks might drill them over the line. And the whistle goes, and that might do it. Yes, it does. Game is over. Brave fight by the Irish. But they still haven't beaten the All Blacks, who have prevailed here tonight at Waikato Stadium in a cracking test match. 34 points to 23. Oh, wonderful contest. Ireland, well, they showed great spirit, courage, and determination. It wasn't enough, but they certainly came, and they were certainly competitive.